Apple iPhone 16 series is going to be coming with an upgraded display, battery and the software. Hey what's up guys, welcome back to another video. So guys, we know that Apple iPhone 16 series is going to be launching in the month of September and we have two to three months remaining for that particular event to happen. Now we have certain leaks and rumors regarding the iPhone 16 series, particularly for the iPhone 16 Pro models, which are going to be giving us a pretty much good idea what to expect. Now starting with the design, the upcoming iPhone 16 series is going to be happening with a bunch of new improvements both in the Pro and the non-Pro models. Like in non-Pro models, the iPhone 16 and the 16 Plus are going to be having a new vertical camera design which is going to be looking kind of a similar to the iPhone X which we have seen a couple of years back. Now this new design will be coming with an upgraded cameras which are going to be much more improved and we are also going to be seeing that the special video recording is going to be coming for these devices. Now another interesting thing you will see on the Pro models despite having that is the upgrade in terms of the display. We are now going to be seeing a new and improved 6.9 inch display for the iPhone 16 Pro Max and also we can expect to see a 6.3 inch display for the 16 pro model so definitely there is going to be an improvement in terms of the display now talking about the display there has been a new leak today which give us a detail about the quality of the display is going to be ET News has speculated that Samsung is going to be giving the M14 OLED display panel to the iPhone 16 Pro models which are going to be much more improved in terms of their brightness and they are also going to be bringing power efficiency for the upcoming iPhone 16 series. The other phone that are using that particular display is going to be the Google Pixel 9 Pro and you know, a previous report out of China claimed that this year iPhone 16 model will feature up to 1200 nits of typical SDR brightness which is a 20% increase over the current model. While the HDR performance is going to be 1600, same as this year iPhone 15 Pro display. So definitely we can see an improvement in the HDR, but the HDR performance will remain the same. Now moving towards the battery side, as you know that EU law has been requiring a smartphone manufacturer to ensure batteries can be replaced by owners using easily accessible tools by 2025. A leaked image has been leaked which give us a detail about the iPhone 16 Pro battery which is going to be coming in a metal casing. Well the reason behind the metal casing is simple that applying a low voltage of electricity will bring this new battery out of the chassis and you can easily place that. Previous method was a challenging and it involves removing adhesive strips with a tweezer. Now a report coming from China Times give us a detail that Apple is planning to order an absurd number of A18 chipset. In fact, it is estimated that Apple has ordered between 90 million and 100 million units of processor which will be mass produced using TSMC 3 nanometer processor. Now, rumor has it that for four iPhone 16 model, we can see an improvement in A18 and A18 Pro chipset because Apple intelligence only support the latest and the greatest processor. But right now, it's unclear that whether iPhone 16 Pro and the Pro Max will be getting more powerful A18 Pro or not. China Times also claims that all four iPhone 16 models will be coming with an 8GB of RAM option and Apple has also confirmed that RAM is one of the most important factor in Apple intelligence compatibility. So by upgrading the iPhone 16 and the 16 Plus for 6GB, it means AI won't be restricted to people willing to pay extra for the Pro models. And you guys, we are a couple of months away before the iPhone 16 series is going to be announcing in September. So in order to keep yourself updated, do consider subscribing to my channel. Thanks for watching. Peace out.